Hello and welcome back to my virtual science tutorial. For our today's discussion, we're going to talk about the differences between observation and inference. Now let's start with an observation. Observation means gathering information using senses. When doing an observation, we used our senses. Now, what are these senses? It can be sense of sight, sense of smell, sense of taste, sense of hear or sense of hearing, and sense of touch. Once again, we used these senses in observing or gathering information. Now, let us observe this picture. What can you say about it? Of course, since we can only see this picture, you will use your sense of sight to gather some information about this girl. Alright, so some of you might answer this. The girl is eating an apple. The color of the apple is red. The color of her hair is orange. The color of her skirt is blue. And the color of her shirt is pink. Okay? So if your answer was like this, then you got it correct. Now that you understand what observation is, let us proceed with inference. Inference or inferences are based on real observed evidence. It is an informed guess about science or scientific relationships. When we said inference, it is just like forming a hypothesis, wherein you are guessing. It is based on real evidence based on your observation. You can say that a person is sad because he is hungry. The phrase is sad is your observation because it is what he looked like. And the phrase is hungry is an inference. Because we can just say it based on what have you observed. Now, let us infer. Let us use this picture or image again. How does she feel? Why is she sitting there? Why she only eats an apple? We can say that the girl is hungry, that's why she is eating an apple. Or, the girl is on her diet, that's why uh, she only eats an apple. Or, the girl is tired, that's why she is sitting there. The reason why you infer or say those things or these answers is because of your observation. Once again, here is the summary of our lesson. Observation means observing using our senses. Then when we said inference, it is an event or things that might happen based on what we observe. So we can infer because of what we have observed. That's it for today. Thank you and see you next science meeting.